A big step forward in the program to develop an indigenous uh, fighter jet for the Navy's aircraft carriers. A naval a variant of the indigenous uh, Tejas light combat aircraft used a hook mounted on its fuselage to snare a wire at a test facility to rapidly come to a halt. Now, this was the first time that an Indian fighter jet made what is called an arrested landing. Uh, today's test at the Goa Bay Shore Base's test facility replicates the conditions on an aircraft where fighter jets have to snag a wire on the deck of the ship in order to abruptly stop within the length of the narrow deck of an aircraft carrier. Now, if these tests progress well, then engineers working on the project hope that they will uh, be given permission to land on the deck of India's only aircraft carrier, the INS Vikramaditya, this winter. Earlier, we spoke to Vishnu Shom for more. It basically means that India has in-house been able to develop the technology to land an indigenous fighter aircraft onto the deck of an aircraft carrier. Remember, aircraft carriers are very small. The length of the runway is tiny compared to a normal airstrip. So for a fighter aircraft to actually be able to land on an aircraft carrier requires, as you mentioned, the, the fitment of what is called a hook on the fuselage of the aircraft. This hook then traps three wire, one of three wires which are mounted across the deck of the aircraft carrier's landing zone. And then as a result of this, the aircraft comes to a violent halt. Now, in order to be able to do this, you need to test several technologies. The, the structure of the aircraft needs to be very strong. Uh, it, the approach angle needs to be just about perfect. The speeds have to be tested repeatedly. And the Indian uh, Tejas aircraft, which has been inducted in the Indian Air Force, for several years, uh, the Navy engineers have been trying to see whether they can get a variant on to India's aircraft carrier, the INS Vikramaditya. In order to do this, they needed to test that hook mounted on the fuselage and or to um, at a test facility in Goa and see if, which replicates the conditions of the aircraft carrier to see if the jet could actually make an arrested landing. Today, they have been able to achieve that. Many more tests will happen. Finally, hopefully, by this winter, we'll be able to test this aircraft on board the deck of the Vikramaditya. But whether or not it is officially bought and purchased and inducted into the Indian Navy, that will still take several years from now to decide.